Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie farming in the Philippines. What a great day! Well, we fucked up with Bob not coming here today, it's tomorrow. You know, not to worry. Chick said, look, here's, here's his messenger, it says Tuesday. I said, yeah, I know. And uh, Joy said Wednesday, I said, so, let's move on. Put your hands above your head. Now you've built a bridge, fucking get over it. Right, so this light here, guys, I've got a problem with this light. It's staying on during the day. And it's only half lit up of night time because of some um, the power on that side of things. So I contacted my supplier, and I said um, I sent him a video, a uh, five second video on it. And she replied back to me. She said I've just contacted the tech. They said there could be moisture inside that's affecting it. Um, have you had a lot of rain lately? Well, well, fucking every day's fucking raining here. You know. She said no problem. What we'll do is um, if it hasn't settled. In the next couple of days, we'll send you out a full replacement model straight away. So I said, oh, thank you very much. So it's a pretty good deal, guys. Pretty good deal. So the rest are going good. However, I've got to move them around. Now that we've had them up for um, two weeks and we're seeing what they're like. Now, this one here shit itself. This was one that we bought from um, Lazada. And believe it or not, this fucking shit one here, this cost the same price as that big 300 water. You know, the same price. So this one shit itself. So I've measured from from the light here at the front porch up to the light that's not working-ish. And that's um, 20 metres. So I've just come down now 20 metres here. And that puts me roughly about here. So I'm going to put it where this light was we put up here. So I'm going to put it here. And that will light up this area here. And um, I'll be able to put another one over there later. Another one over there. So that area is lit up. What I'm thinking of doing, I'll test it tonight. Now, if this one lights up really good here, what I might be able to do, now this is maybe a might, maybe, what I might be able to do, I can put put another light, the same as Mountain Man Philippines, join two together, put another light up here. Now that would light up this area, but there's always a but, isn't there? I love you, but, <laughs> get fucked. But, of course, the shadow is going to be here from the roof. So what I want to really do is just put one in here, in the middle here somewhere, probably about where I'm standing now. And that way it will light up over there, over to here. The front one is lighting up over there. That one's lighting there. And I've got the full house lit up. Lit up like fucking NASA can see us from bloody the space station, mate. But um, that's how it's going to go. That's how it's going to go. <coughs> so I'm going to put one in there. I'm going to put one in there, and I'm going to pull that one out over there. And here's Alfredo now to give me a hand. And we, we booked him today because we thought Bob was coming today. So you can't you can't turn around and say, oh, look, we don't need you today, come tomorrow. That's not the fucking way we work on the farm. No, we're human beings, the same as they are. So we've got plenty of work we can do instead. So we'll leave it at that. Good morning, Fredo. Hello. G'day. Hello. Hello. Happy? happy, happy. Oh, he's always fucking happy, this guy, I tell you. Must get lots of sex from his wife of the night time, I think. Or a morning. Mm. Oh, shut up, goats. All right, so let's get into this, guys. All right, guys. Right, let me just knock this one down. Right, I want to show you a trick on... Um, since I've been resting up on Sunday and Monday, is uh, I watch a lot of the internet on... Chicken and goats. What's all the internet on um, handyman um, tricks and tricks of the trade? And here's one I want to show you now. Okay, so what they do, one guy's done, not they do, but one guy, what he's done, you get these magnets. These come from Andreas Martin. They're good when you're working and you can put all your nuts and bolts on and uh, they won't fall off the bowl. So they're very, very good. And what this guy actually did was he took, he undone the bolt on here and he screwed it onto here. So that when, when he does his welding, all he has to do is just, is just pick it up and voila. That's all he has to do, just like that. Isn't that amazing? I tell you, absolutely white man magic. So I'm not gonna drill through this one, but I'm just gonna sit in there. Right, so I'll show you how it goes. Oh. Oh. Right, we've got the stick, we've got that. 
where are you? I can't see. Hold the camera and at the same time. Well, it didn't work because I've got all that side done. So what's happening now? Ugh. Mm. Ugh. Get back in here again. Yeah! Right. Right. does work, I tell you. Magnetic. Alright, so that's welded on. So Afrid I now will give it the uh, the red oxide. So we red oxide him all the way around to look sexy, just like these bastards up over here. No, not these ones here. These bastards. Now these are the first ones we bought, and these were twice the price of those ones. Twice the price. Seriously, and at uh, 51, 52, or whatever it is, percent off. Definitely worth buying, guys. Definitely worth buying. So I put them now every 20 metres around and um, it works. Lights up the whole place like a fucking Christmas tree. Really does. There's one up over there, there's one up over there, one up there, one there. And then one up over the back there, there's one over there, there's one over there, there's one over there. Everything is dead there, here's a dead there, there. Oh, everywhere's a dead there. Right. Okay, so that one's changed over. It was a wash time. Yeah, I love this um, setting. Oh, it's, so it's like a, uh, it's like a low volume pressure. <laughs> so today's bath day for your dogs. Yeah. So once a week you got to wash your dogs, guys. Once a week. And what Chick uses is this stuff here. Okay, this is called Doggy's Choice. Not from the People's Choice Awards. Doggy's Choice Tea and Flick Shampoo with Conditioner. How fucking good is that? All right. Good and good smell. You got from this one? Andreas Martin. Oh, from Andreas Martin. Look, this one gets a, puts a smell on them. Mm -mm. Thank you, Andreas Martin. And thank you, Bob, for your hose with that setting. Jeez, he likes that it. shit. Yeah, look. <laughs> likes that shit. Hey, so we're on this side, the master bedroom. We call this the master bedroom wing. It's over this side here. So it's dead in the middle here. It's in line here, so we can come across with the right on mower. And just go through in one line when we do all this. So now we've got all the lights covered. Tree roots. I should sharpen that blade up actually on that. Hit it with a grinder. Give it a sharpen up. I'll do that because tomorrow we're putting all those fences in down over here tomorrow. So we'll cut through better. Oh, a rock. The odd rock or two. Right, done. So when I repaint the house, which is going to be soon, then um, the same green I'll put onto here. And if Chick wants to put a garden here or put some ferns on there or anything like that, she can grow something on this quite nicely. So it won't look too bad. Won't look out of place. I didn't like steel light poles when I first put the, when I first built the farm. So I wanted the wooden one so that it matches in. You know, like you can see by this wooden one up over here, that's only a 12 footer. But you needed the height. So the only way to do it is to go steel. It's the only way to do it. I'll have to cut this mulberry a bit. This one's going right up to the light. But overall, I think I'm quite happy. I'm quite happy. So let's see how it goes tonight, guys. And we'll finish this video tonight. Yeah! Right, guys, so it's night time. So this is one of the original lights. I'd still like to stick a big 300 watt here to light up. But it lights up the gate quite well. So let's go down this way and head towards the house. Let's see mm. what... This one's dark you have to do here. something over that sign. Yeah, this one I really want a uh, light here. One out uh, at least two, Han. Definitely. Mm. Up the pathway. This yeah. one of the old original lights we had. Two only. Two. Now, these lights cost the same price as these 300 watts, guys. If you use my code, which is in the description box. Now, if you just go into Lazada and type in 300 watt my home lights. You're going to pay the full price but if you use the code you get over the 55 58 percent so this is the ones we had before like how many how tall is this hand oh that's only 12 foot 
got a curl foot. Oh, there we go. Wow. These are on the six meter ones. Have a look at this round here, Dulls. Mm. Have a look at that, guys. I'll mm. tell you what, space station will be able to see us. But no more <laughs> lights. We're saving power because there's no more lights on the house. We don't need it. Yeah. On that side. Let's go, baby. And this is the new one we put in today over this corner. There's still a dark corner over the back. But yeah. um, we could either put a double one up on the back corner, a double one over there. Like so, two in a, in one pole? Yeah, one going north, uh, one going east, one going west. Yeah. And that will light up that back corner. Yeah, that but all corner this is, lit is up so nice dark. Now. That was mm. very dark before. That's where Sam barks a lot. I yeah. don't know what he sees that we cannot see. So I think we'll do that one tomorrow. This is our original first one. Our first one lights up all the front porch area. Mm. Right, we keep walking up towards the back. So this is the light we replaced today, guys. Remember I said it was on during the day and um, the control wasn't working? When I took it down and hit, to hit the button on, on the device, there's an on-off button on the device, it reset itself and it works perfect. Mm. So um, I don't have an issue with that now. Mm -hmm. Don't have an issue. So I can use that light. And that, there it is over here, look. Uh-huh. So if I... Oh! Voila. Wolf. Oi. Uh -huh, turn off. Oh, you will let me bend, darling. <laughs> Would you bend for a friend? <laughs> so this is one of the old original ones with the solar panel. We thought they were good at their time but they're nothing compared to these 300 waters. Mm. So I still want to put one over here behind the bamboo. I want to put one behind there I'm to light be up in between that area. Han, I'm going to be planting jackfruit there. That's good, darling. I already pegged it. Yeah, but it's going to be near the um, mulberry. Uh, yeah. Come on, come on darling. Come on, like just a few meters from Feels the mulberry. You're fucking falling asleep watching you, darling. <laughs> right, so this one here, as you know, lights up this area here. Now the one over here, I've turned that around today just to test. Normally it's lighting down in the creek. So I've turned it around to see what it's like in here, but I'm not happy with that. So tomorrow I'll turn it back again so it lights up behind the creek area. Mm. Down through there. Finish. This is the, uh, the one we had on the old corner post, lighting up all this area here. And of course, the one in the corner over here, voila. Once I cut down those palm fronds, it lights up the whole area. Mm. So there you go. I'll put the link, guys, in the uh, description down below. It's not pull out the drawer of the TV and see where it is underneath. So in the description box, you'll see that. Now, I'm very impressed with these lights. And if you turn around and have a look at all those, baby. Yeah. Looks bloody good. Also bright. Well, I'm definitely going to turn that one around yeah. the opposite way. Uh, Alright guys, thanks for watching us on the Aussie farm. This is William, this is Chick on the Aussie farm in the Philippines. Have a look down below. Mountain Man has brought over a dozen of them. I've brought nearly a dozen. Oh, I think I brought about 10 of the bastards now. Do a dozen still... no hunt. A dozen now. Mm. There you go. And I'll tell you, it's well worth it guys. Well worth it. Now, it's only for security where people see the lights and it won't come. Even though we have the infrared cameras, in pitch black, we can see straight through all this anyway. But it's a mind thing for people that they see the lights and they want to stay in the shadows. But the cameras pick them up anyway. But there you go, guys. This is us on the Aussie farm in the Philippines. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Share, subscribe, or bye.